No. The Bible says, lay aside every weight. Lay aside every hindrance. See, we're trying to ride the race that God has for us, but we're still carrying around the junk. We're still carrying around the baggage that we, we've got. So, that, you know, that, that sin that's, that's, that's been in our lives. We're trying to run God's race, but you can't run the race that God has truly called you with all these old stuff. You gotta let it go. The Bible says, you lay inside of you. The Bible says, watch out for the You might. Lay aside everything. Lay aside every sin. And begin to look to Jesus. Some of those sins might be big, like that one. Might be, you know, this big, honking, chunking sin. This is a big, learned thing. And you say, yeah, I know, I know, I've got to get rid of it. But, but some of us have a convenient sin, a little backpack size. And you know that it's holding you back. You know it's an area of your life where you're, you are not pursuing God the way you're supposed to pursue Him. Maybe you say, you know what? I, I know that it, maybe it's maybe something that not very many people know about. Maybe it's, maybe it's just as simple as something on your iPad or iPod. Do you even know it had no business being there? It's not of God. It's not drawing you closer to the things of God. But you say, you know what I'm saying? I paid a dollar and 29 cents for that song. You want me to delete that song? Yes! You're going to let a dollar and 29 cents rob you from doing what God is calling you to do? church, I'm going to act all churchy, right? Because we know how to act churchy. We know how to say, hallelujah. Hallelujah. It's all my dear. How you been? Praise God. Oh, I should have moved quite right. I don't know why you are not How you been? And so we play, we put our little sins there, and here, and you just leave it. You're going into church, and you just, you just leave it. 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 Go to church, and then you can have you a thing. As you walk into church, you just take it right back up there. See, God is looking for you to take some of these things, some of these sin, some of this trash, and to begin to project it on your life. You want to run the race, but you can't run to get your ball down. You're trying to run the race that God has called you to. You can't run it fully because you're, you're holding back because you're carrying stuff that you're not supposed to carry. You're trying to go after the things of God, but you're still caught up in this sin and still caught up in this habit, and you don't know how to break free. I'll tell you something. We serve a God that, that there is no sin, there is no habit, that He will not provide a way, a way for a state. falls out of your hand no more. 